Assalamu alaikum students. Hope you all are fine. Welcome to MLS Online Virtual Classroom. Page number 24. Unit number 2A. Geometry and Problem Solving. Students, today our target is Introduction to Basic Geometric Shapes. Now it's question number one. Copy and complete the sentences using information given. Now students look at the first one that is the octagon. Regular pentagon has double the number of sides of a kite. Triangle. Rectangle has three corners and has equal sides and equal angles. Hexagon has four right angles, has six sides of different length. Hexa is ki four sides hoti hai. Octa has eight sides. And has sides, five sides of a different length, irregular pentagon. Penta, five. Now shape A is a dash because it dash. Shape B is a dash because it is dash. You have to fill these blanks. So students at the bottom of this question, here are shapes given. A, B, rectangle, C, Count these 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 6 hexagon. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 penta. 1, 2, 3 triangle. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 pentagon. So shape A is an dash because it dash. What will be answer? Think it. Shape A is an irregular hexagon because it has six slides of different lengths. Shape B is a rectangle because it has four right angles. Shape C is a regular hexagon because it has six equal sides and equal angles. Shape D is a regular pentagon because it has five equal sides. Shape E is a triangle because it has three corners. Shape F is an irregular pentagon because it has five sides of different lengths. So dear students, this is the complete solution of the previous slide. You have to write down these red words in your blanks. Okay, dear students, question number two, A part. Which of these shapes is pentagon, hexagon, or octagon? You have to find out penta, five sides, hexa, six, octa, eight. It's B part. Name the leftover shape.
Yes, any one of you tell me its solution. Yes, you are right. A has five sides. One, two, three, four, five. So it is a pentagon. B, C, and E are hexa. Now count it. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. So B, C, and E are hexagon. F. Now look at the shape F. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So shape F has eight sides. So F is octagon. G, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So shape F and G are octagon. Name the left over shapes. D. D is tetragon. Tetra equals to try three. One, two, three. Now, dear students, try use a pair of scissors and paper square. What different shapes can you make if you cut? You can make if you cut the square into two parts. By using scissor, what different shapes you can make if you cut the square into two different parts. If we cut square diagonally, then we will get two. Yes, you can get two triangles. These are diagonals. And if we cut square in this fashion, they will get two rectangles. In this way. When you cut a square from opposite sides, you can get two triangles. When you cut a square from top to bottom, up to down, you can get two rectangles. One, two. So dear students, this is end of the class. Thank you.